tight one. Tide times are good again today. I actually ran out of battery yesterday. Um, all of my batteries ran out. Nah, but I got a charger today and I've ordered some more because I found so many targets. Okay, iffy. I wouldn't be surprised if that's mixed. Another small one. Remember, look at that, it's very, very small. Maybe a front of an old button or something. But yeah, remember, if you want sensationalized metal detecting videos with clickbait bullshit titles, you are watching the wrong channel, yeah? I'm not gonna be pulling 57 silver coins within three minutes, okay? Okay, not the best sounding target. What am I going for here? I'll explain. I'm going for, I'm wanting to see how small we can go with the targets. Like yesterday, there was some pretty impressive size stuff. Um, yeah, so I'm wanting to see, I'm wanting to see. I had people going like, oh, you know, not sensitive, da da da. Multi frequency will pick up smaller stuff. There we go, small piece of copper. That's a tight one as well. Yeah, this, I've said it before, but this, this area basically acts like a draining board, you know? I found a lot of buttons and bits and pieces here. Okay, yeah, we have got another small piece of of something. Is it a waste of time? Let's think about this. Is it a waste of time trying to dig these tiny little targets? And the answer I have for you is no, it isn't. Because if you can hear the small targets, there it is, small piece of lead. If you can hear the small targets, then you know you're not missing much. Okay, that's why I go for them. Also, I'm gonna be getting out with my Nexus machines. Uh, my fields are waterlogged. I'm quite excited because I'm actually, I've actually managed to get some more farmland down where I film a lot of my Nexus videos in Hampshire. So that's gonna be cool. And it's actually good land as well. So I'll be using my Nexus machines loads. But yeah, I need to, lead or aluminium. Yeah, I need to let them dry out a bit. Close to the surface, this. a nice military button. Oh. Mind you, I've said it before where these sort of rings wash up, so the buttons. Right next to that ring. this it's round we like round that's most probably a crusty crusty 1p Little 
button. Okay, there's a little button. It, what's it got on it? Anything? Yeah, it has, but it's too small to see. That's a nice one, though. Really nice one. Yeah, it's got patterning on it. It's another nice one. I've got my uh, got my vibrator set to 4.79. So, and I think that's probably why I'm hitting on all these smaller targets, you know. Holy moly, this is annoying. Look, is that it? Yeah, what is that? Anything of any consequence? Hmm, I don't know. That might be a top of a knife. Yeah, that looks like an old knife or some kind of spatula thing in me jig. I expect the, the wooden handle went there. leaning towards digging I haven't really gone over the large stone you know where there is large stones I haven't done it for a very long time Very small piece of lead. Do a check. Nothing exciting at the moment. I've got so many signals here close together what I'm going to do is just basically um, try and separate them crusty 2p for starters here we go nice and slow there's another one Nice and slow. It's a piece of nothing. I was getting really excited about that piece of nothing. I was kind of like, wee, I found no a piece of nothing. Come on. What's this? It's a, it's a thing. That was definitely it. Okay. I think there's more. Look at that. Look at that. 
iron. I'm hunting in surfboard iron. Pull my trousers up. I found old coins on this little patch. Um, okay, hopefully whatever it is, is in here. Is that it? Yeah. That is, what is it? Just another small piece of lead. than that. Oh, there we go, a coin. And it's an old one. Sweet. I can see Britannia there. Um... Can't get a date. 19... 1920 something or So I think, like, it does lock on very well. Um, oh look, look at that on my spade. It's a washer, I thought it was a button. Oh. Well, we're lucky with the weather, I've got to say. It's really, really nice. I, I don't like autumn and when the leaves are falling and all that. There's people out there that are like, yeah, I love it, but I prefer spring when everything around me isn't dying. Uh, yeah. Ha ha, look, that's making my garret go off. little screws that we all love I do anyway 
Let's just check. I think that was it. Yeah. Okay. Got another nice signal there. Oh wow, look. That's probably it. Tiny little washer. Let's see. Nice. Okay. Some connect. No, oh, it's not even a connector, some plate of some kind. <clears throat> Again, when you, you kind of hit into an area where you've got a lot of targets, you've got to slow it right down. Oh yeah, I found lots of these. Very old. If I can get a small coil for this, I love all of these. Like I said, I put them in a jar. Yeah, if I can get a small coil for this machine, it's gonna be bleeding. Brilliant. So it's doing well considering it's a it's a largish coil really, you know. It is doing really well. So if I can get a small one. tiny piece of something that actually looks like it used to have a pattern on it. All from this same area. Ah, there we go, look, another one of those. Another one for the pot. Look at that, just literally, just under the surface, little close button. See, this is what I'm saying to you. When I do those demonstrations of unmasking, I'm not talking crap, you know? All of the stuff on the Thames is literally just on the surface or just under. That's why those sort of tests are quite good. Okay, well that picked that up through that rock. Yeah, that picked that up through that rock. It's more in the hole. That. No, just another piece of random metal. But this is the reality of metal detecting on the Thames, okay? I refuse to edit together all good stuff. This is the reality. This is what metal detecting is. You know? If you want to watch people dig in planted finds, go on most of the big YouTube channels. I have to say 
the more I use this machine, the more I like it. It just sounds cool, it feels cool, and it is cool. Um, obviously not the most uh, detailed description. But everything's cool. Apart from the human race, Is it out or is it that? Oh, hang on. Is that it? I saw something then that... I think we're just dealing with a very small... There it is. Yeah. Ooh. See, but the reason why I love being able to pick and it, these targets out is because you don't know. Like I found Roman fragments, tiny Roman coin fragments. They've been in the fields, but there must be stuff here. Like for instance, that. When I look at that, right, that's definitely got some markings on it. It has. It's not my imagination. It's not my imagination at all. Actually, I think I can see a figure on that. That's why I love picking the small stuff up. Yeah, I'm going to look closer at that when I get home. I think I can see a figure on that. Very tight. Very tight. Come on, man. Let's dig a nice thing. Okay, it's in the chalk. This is going to be fun. Is that it? Is it a coin? Um, it's going to be a 2p, isn't it? Because 2p's follow me around like a bad, bad smell, man. That was it. <sighs> yeah, that to me sounds like a better one. It's not thumping. It's just right. small round ring ring me jig
it's a small pistol ball. That was down there a bit as well, actually. That was down there a little bit. 